Hi, and uh, welcome back to the Annie House series. It's been a while since I did the last video. I've been busy with work. Alright, so the yeah, country has opened up. I think almost everybody has forgot what is COVID, but I'm still wearing a mask because majority of them are still wearing the mask here in Bangkok. Okay, but if you don't wear, I just feel like a little bit out of place. So just wearing it. Okay, so yes, I'm still very much in Bangkok. So lots of tourists are coming in since the country is opening up. But of course, if you know if you like to visit here, apart from eating, shopping, I know there's still something that they can do. So I chanced upon this uh, very interesting website. Okay, it's called Expo Bangkok. And they have this very interesting treasure hunt walk. Okay, you can see from here. Okay, so today I'm going to explore them. Okay, I will be choosing the full journey, which is four hours. Okay, there are some instructions over here. And now I'm heading towards the starting line. Okay, so the starting place over here is says Spatunam Port Station. Okay, and along the way, well, I think you'll be given quiz and some tasks to do. I'm not sure how it is going to be like. So let's go and check it out. All right, so here I am at the start, starting destination. Okay, so I started the mission and I have to board the boat and it goes all the way to the last pier. So there's a question over here that asks which animal is represented on the coat of arms in the middle of the bridge. Oh, okay, okay, I think I found it. Okay, there's a small answer to choose from a snake, an elephant, a turtle, and a monitor lizard. Alright, so you can see in the middle of the bridge, there's this black color, yeah, wording. I think right in the middle, I see an elephant. Let's see if I can get it right. So, an elephant, and check. Yes, congratulations, it's an elephant. Okay, I got my first mission, first point. So, Oh, I'm just gonna board the boat. But please check and make sure that the boat is actually in operation. You know, sometimes on certain days or a special public holiday, they don't operate. Right, that was during COVID, but now I think they operate every day. So, come. Alright, so here I am on the boat, heading towards the next destination. So, one ticket is 14 baht, one four. Okay, you just have to take all the way to the last station. And of course along the way you can see some very interesting sites that they wore the thing. And you also will pass by the Thompson Silk Museum. Alright, so you enjoy the other part of the city that most people won't explore. Okay, especially the King Day River boat. Okay, so I've reached the last pier. And my walking quest begins now. And for this wall, probably you must be able to cover a good 8km by walking. So it will take probably about 4 hours to complete this quest. And the other quest is actually two and a half hours with a different starting point. So let's see. The first mission. Buddhist calendar. Yeah, okay, so Thailand uses Buddhist calendar. So this year is actually 2566. So to find the actual year, you just need to deduct 543. So the first question is the construction year of this bridge in Gregorian calendar. So that's the bridge, okay. As I can see over there, it says two, four, five, seven. So minus five hundred and forty-three. It should be. Let me see. Nineteen forty. Yeah. Two, four, five, seven minus five hundred and forty-three. Nineteen fourteen. So my answer should be 1914. Check. Alright. Alright. Nice. Okay, so definitely there's a lot more to explore. 
and the gain point. So, come. Okay, so the next question, <laughs> very simple. Why is the Thai beer brand whose logo represent an animal craft on the bridge? It might be worth taking a look at 7-Eleven store. Okay, I think it's very easy. Chang, okay. Chang is actually um, elephant in Thai. Okay, so let's see. Oh no, legendary lion. I got this wrong. Okay, I thought it's Chang. <laughs> oh, never mind. More points to collect. Okay, let's keep exploring. Let's go. Bye. Here at the giant swing. So, yeah, just a piece of advice, okay? You require some level of navigation skill, okay? Because some of the instruction that leads you to the next le um, destination, all right, the next location isn't very clear. All right, thankfully, I'm quite familiar with this place, but still, I struggle a little. At certain locations, I still have to use Google Map, okay? So, ensure that your phone is fully charged. I'll bring a spare battery power bank you have to charge your phone while doing the quest okay so well i will not be reviewing some of the questions so you have to explore them on your own okay so i'll just have to go alone and explore more location and uh, just in case that if you are lost okay you can use the gps map to proceed to your link's location. It's all in the website. Okay, so this is bringing me to this little alley, which is something that I don't do, or you or me won't do. This is the Ong Ang Canal, Walking Street. Okay, you can see this painting over here. All right, it's actually a painted manhole. Okay, you can actually find some of them over along this street. In fact, there's a route that you can explore to look out for this nicely painted manhole. All right, so I will do a separate video on this. So the next location is actually Chinatown.
to the market street plenty of stuff ranging from facial bags water bottle food drinks I ended up buying laundry bag and sour plum <laughs> not bad I at least can get something that I need Okay, I'm out of that market. Spend longer than usual uh, because I have a lot of things to buy. Okay, the things are quite cheap, I would say. Okay, I almost forgot that I'm on the mission to find the car. So yeah, I'm towards the car right now. Okay, so this uh, treasure hunt style, all right, is quite an interesting way to explore the city of Bangkok. Okay, and uh, it's probably is spend probably a half a half a day, so slightly more. Okay, the instruction. Probably are not very clear. The clue given, well, you really have to explore a little, okay, and then pay a little bit more attention. I got a lot of wrong answer, okay, but anyway, it's quite nice to actually spend half a day or a day, all right, to explore by foot. I'm probably about close to four hours, okay, so let's head to my last mission. So hidden in this small little alley, there are some nice cafe, really nice cafe. And yeah, this is actually a very popular peanut candy shop. I think they are not open today. Okay, so this is the... Alright, I found a car. Okay, so this is quite a fun way to explore the city on foot. Alright, through finding mission, finding answers to certain questions. And let's see how well I did. Okay, I <laughs> did 20 right out of 45 questions. <laughs> Probably I didn't really pay attention. Weather is a little bit warm, okay? Got a little bit hungry, trying to rush certain places, trying to get through to the next stage. But it's a fun way, as I say, to explore the city on foot. Spend a couple of four hours to four and a half hours if you can. And the weather is hot, okay, definitely. So do remember to hydrate. But there are plenty of drinks and water stations, right? Shops that you can actually find. So, yep, this is it. Okay, till the next one. I'll see you on the Anyhow series.